Welcome back to Super Beard Brothers. We are on top of the clouds. I'm going to read the green. Read that green, baby. It's just a power oh, cell. It's great. just a battery. Another Got it. One of these power cells. Well, what do I do with it? Man, yeah, good question. What? what do you think would happen if Aloy found and interacted with an MP3 of the song PlayStation by Eiffel 65? Like, do you think it would break her brain? I think she'd be offended that she wasn't in it. <laughs> Horizon Zero Dawn. Horizon. X-Files. Got a war, the new one. <laughs> the new one. Specifically, the new God of War. They should patch songs with lyrics that are more appropriate to the time period. That's what I'm saying. Like, media that comes out, we should just keep updating it so that it stays relevant. Come on, let's twist again. Like we did 65 years ago. Yes, I believe I do. The thing has been repeated. Okay. Oh, is that her? Yeah, it's probably. Is she here? Elizabeth, good to, uh, it's been years. It's really obvious your legal team, Ted? that this is Dead Stranding looking at this. all 18 lawsuits the money landed. I assume your daddy confirms us. I'm trying to get, like, a good frame. Mm -hmm. All right, this promises to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You screwed something up, something big, or you wouldn't have eaten Fucked the crumb up, necessary to get me here. Fucked up. So spit it out. There's a glitch in the chariot line. Your killer robots? Peacekeepers, mm. yes, those. Mm. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? It's wandering around. It's worse than that. Show me the data then. And I'll take that lunch alone. Oops. For so such Charo brought Elizabeth Sobek here. You think Sobek and Ted other? have history together? Of course they do. Romantic history. Of course they do. Oh. You know, what's what's fascinating to me is that like for such like a shrewd and obviously evil businessman, you think he'd take measures to make sure that his secret meetings wouldn't be recorded. This isn't a glitch. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a catastrophe. Very so convenient aware. for the purposes of this story. It's Correct. bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. Mm. You built a line of killer Ted. robots. How Peace could you, man? Keepers. That consume biomass as fuel. In emergencies. And you made them capable of self-replication. Limited, self-manufacture, controlled. <laughs> Not well. anymore. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. Oops. You, you think I did? Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. Oops. We're not talking fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. How did it balance? That's my question. So the planet should be like scoured and there should just be it's robots, right? It can't be. You know what I mean? Right. Before the truth gets out, you mean. Liz, I will Aloy do doesn't seem too upset. Say. Keep working it and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. Alright, Ted. Alright. Oh, wait. Still going? Oh, no. They're Is done. this about us? Zero robots. What if he said that? Life on Earth. But somehow she defeated them. Mm. Nope. The world of the old ones fell, but life went on. Mm -hmm, or mm -hmm. we wouldn't be here. Oh, I guess that's true. So I, I guess she found, found a way to shut down their full-on spread and replication. Well, didn't we see them all, like, doing suicide drugs stuff earlier? Maybe that was during the panic. Yeah. But I guess she also cradled her DNA and a bunch of other people's Project DNA in the future. Zero Dawn. Jesus, Liz. Zero Dawn. Death We're finding out the answers. Life. If there were a nicer way to fix your mess, <clears throat> I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's Shut the fuck up. Dead. You made killer robots it's that eat flesh. But it's our only chance. Ted? Now sign the proposal. Sign it? I can't sign that. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. You've got a choice, Ted. I know. I'm speaking to you from a VTOL en route to U.S. Robot Command. 
In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? She's gonna tattle. Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Jesus okay. Mess. You don't have to threaten me. Seems like she did, dude. I'll sign. Look on the bright side, Ted. From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. Yeah, take that, Ted. Forgive me. Why is she floating in the table? She's not actually there. She's like a hologram. We're watching a hologram of a hologram? Correct. Made her solution so terrible. What does she do to stop the robot? Watch the next cutscene to find out. New file available. Executive access detected. Right. You know what I wish? You know what would have been cool if, like, Aloy were affected by this and cared? Like, she, she just doesn't know, yeah. It, it'd be nice if, like, this, oh, wait. This doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been oh my, my mother. She lived ages ago. Yeah. All this searching, and I'm still no closer. To what? No, you're you pretty close. You just learned to whine like a spoiled child. Dude, Zavala's pissed. <sighs> You should really try talking that way to me face to face. Okay, what do you wish? Okay. You wish. Oh, do you really, really have looks no like it? How monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So, you have a face. Got a name She's to like, go with it? Too bad. Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. Yeah. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. And you did it in a day. For years, I've suspected that feral robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. Until and now. Minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime, and what you want to know is my name. Yeah. Silence. That's my name. That's not your name. Now. Why don't you try That's way too cool of a name. That's like the name of a DJ. <laughs> if you're so smart, why aren't you rich? All right, silence. See, she doesn't believe him either. I came to these ruins hoping to learn more about this Elizabeth Sobek. And I have, but I still don't understand my connection to her. Other than you look or exactly like her. Or why trying to kill me. Or who Hades is. No answers, just do you think that we're just waiting after on like exactly which is the why one last thing that she needs to go do, inquiry. and then it will like only then will you see just start humanity again? Really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle, like a crowd of maybe the, the program didn't resolve yet. The common thread like, is your the, connection the to the end of this game is going to be so Aloy, like but what is scanning her fingerprints? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know She's the your connection clone. yet. The only way to Just find out is it. to keep going, to keep making discoveries. Thanks to you. What do you have around your uh, shoulder there, too? Robots once threatened to end life on Earth. It's a bandolier, but... It didn't but... happen. The old one's civilization was destroyed, but life... Life was saved. Obviously. So, what did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots before all was lost? What was Project Zero Dawn? Exactly the question. Now, are you ready to go get the answer? Somewhat, of course I am. but I feel as about connected to this emotionally as I am about any side quest. Mm. Not so fast, Silence. You've got some explaining to do. Let's find out. I've told you. You've got some explaining to do. If you First of all, questions, what's wrong with your head? Quick about it what happened? Stop wasting my time. Who are you, Silence? And what are your intentions? You really need to make this personal. Dude, you're calling me on the phone and making me climb up mountains, bro. I'm a lone wanderer who left his tribe behind a long time ago. Hmm. An explorer of forbidden places, a searcher of lost knowledge. Exactly as I said. Why do you know so much about the Eclipse? I happen to know a lot about a lot of things. 
If what you're really asking is whether I work for the Eclipse or anyone else, I don't. I am nothing if not independent. Now that's enough talking. Be on your way. Mm. Oh no. Come on. I'm just getting started. You've been getting a free ride on my focus. Yeah. Risking nothing while I risk everything. All I have to do is take this thing off my head, and you'll be blind, deaf, and dumb. So quit complaining and answer my questions. Very well. Proceed. You've been using my focus to spy on me. How is that possible? Every focus emits a signal, a voice that only other focuses can hear. Okay. I know how to string those voices together, how to make them talk to each other, to communicate, That's even over vast distances. With you. How do you learn to do that? Years of study I found a YouTube video. In principle, it's not so different from how you override machines. I override I'm not focuses. so clear how we can do that, actually. And you can spy <laughs> through other Eclipse's focuses, too. Usually. All I'll say is that overriding the connections is... Complicated. Now, what the hell are they doing? All right, there's a lot going on. Yep. Should I ask about Hades? If you really want to. He's like the so one thing. It's the one thing I, I want to know the answer to. The Eclipse are just following orders. It's Hades who wants me dead. Who is he? I don't know. The Eclipse described him as a buried. He's shadow, like an AI. Some kind of devil. Mm. That thing that spoke to me outside. It's weird because Hades explode. is like the only thing that's like not Egypt. That Hades. Mm. It, it didn't seem like a person or a machine. More like a phantom. A phantom? A terrible voice. All that's certain is that he wants you dead. Because of my connection Dude. to Elizabeth. I know that he? Aloy is also Hades based off a real person, but her face is not the same as her voice actor. But if Elizabeth so it's really weird to see her like talking to ago. Lance Reddick. If she made special weapons... Maybe Hades is worried I'll do the same thing. In some of the ancient data I've recovered, there are hints of so-called super weapons being developed. Maybe to stop the robots, the mm. civilization of the old ones had to destroy itself. I think maybe Hades is uh, Pharaoh's consciousness. Oh yeah, that's probably true. All right, let's go. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U.S. Robot Command to <laughs> tell people about Zero Dawn. You know. I'd the say that's a dumb exists. name, but Space Force exists. Mm -hmm. The Asaram call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde? Cherry name. You'll find it in the I gotta go to the Grave Horde. Buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil or a BR7 right. Horus, rather, as we're learning. Oh, to we're gonna find out what a I'll Horus is. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I can't wait. Okay. Someday we'll meet in person, and your manners have better be improved. <laughs> Yeah, man, I just really wish Aloy were well, had a bigger reaction to this huge supposed revelation. Next. She's like, yeah, cool hand Luke vibes. You know what would be cool is if, like, at the beginning of this game, like, if, like she started out as someone who was a devout believer in, like, the in lore. their creation myth. Yeah. So then to learn this truth, to be like, no, your God never existed. Your purpose that you thought you had as a seeker or whatever she is, isn't real. This is the truth, and to have her have a big emotional reaction to it, that would have been like, you know, <clears throat> kind of nice. Like a little bit closer to the revelations. Yeah. Have some actual character development. You know what I mean? I feel, I feel, I feel that. As opposed to like, we just had a huge episode and a half worth of info dump, right? Yeah. And Aloy's like, okay, you know what I mean? She's like, yeah, tell me more. Okay, the grave horde, huh? Am I out? Am I outside? Yep. Easy, easy. Easy, easy. easy. What's this? Coffee. Corrupted and zone. Coffee cup. Ton of X. How far is this? Ton of X. We'll talk about that later. All right. Oh. Woo. Oh. You better my. face trade. Yeah. Boy, you better face. Maybe save first. I don't. Yeah. But gonna, if you face trade, you'll be at a save. Right? I think so. I, I'm going to I'm gonna just make sure there's not something I need to do here. No, nothing, right? It's just, I don't think so. Just time to go. All yep. right. I'm going to fast travel. Boy, it's time to face. Well, should I just walk through all this because I've never been here before? Uh, that's your call, man. That is that is your call. Shattered Kiln Bandit Camp. Where can I even travel to? Let's see. All right. Oh wait, hold on now. Yes. Yes. 
Do I do it from the map? Fast travel? You do it from the item, right? Am I tripping? I thought it was from the item, but let me let me go right here. Just to see. You're gonna fast travel right there? Oh, it's just R2. But I mean, I don't wanna miss all this. Whatever you want, man. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna walk. And here we go. And by walk I mean Run! leap and pounce. Could you imagine? I'd be terrified. Could you imagine just seeing that, even if we're at a distance where, like, you know it can never touch you and it's gonna, like, be out of your life forever. Right. I would be haunted by that sight forever. The crazy thing is that it's not even that fast. Like, the, like it's a little, it's faster than I could move using that style of transport. What? I think I saw a video like that on the internet once of, like, they were, it was, like, looked like it was in a park next to a lake. And somebody was running, and like this lady started running on all fours, like a, like a Dark Souls beast. Yeah. After a person, it yep. was terrifying. I'll be freaked out. It's like a nuke's top five. Probably. It seems to be on fire. And there it is. Dire she blows. Doesn't seem efficient. Just need to get them past the fire threshold. I just gotta get them past the fire. I just like. Yep. It's warm. Oh, he's still kicking. Oh, am I drowned? Nope. Oh! Oh! What just happened? One of them exploded. Is this guy gonna like blow up when his fire goes down to the bottom? Nope. Okay. Why are you acting like this? He knows, he knows he's. Oh! Jesus. I mean, he's acting weird. This is on him. I think one of those dudes that goes out and hunts, but they just shoot an animal, let it bleed to death, and leave it there. Nobody does that. I mean, not me. Nobody does that. And by nobody, I mean I don't. Therefore, no one does. <laughs> nobody like me does that. Nobody as cool as me would ever hunt like that. Not like that. I use the whole animal. I would. Better eat those hooves. Better put some milk in them, that bowl of hooves. I would. Big jello. I support I support hunting as long as it's like conservationist. Just a bowl of Ew. I didn't like the sound. Like the sound like took a minute to sink in with me. <sighs> Fucking milk poured over it. Ugh. Ice cold milk and hooves. Oh god. You never get a box of hooves and horns? They're like, they're like hollow too, which is why it's like creepy. Watch on a box of hooves and horns, baby. You guys oh. are too big to what? mess with. Yeah, what the shit is that? You guys are way too big to mess with. What's going on over there anyway? Chicken versus man? Man? Versus man? I can't even get involved in this. Well, but what is the man? You're the man! I was the boy. I can't believe you're doing this. I'm not necessarily doing this. Yes, you are. I'm not- I'm not- Yes, you are! I don't want to get involved. You're wanna, getting so close. Oh, they're just bandits! I thought this was like, you know, like when you run into like something happening in the world and you need to like go see so you can get a quest. I see. But no, it's really, just people dying. Yeah, it's just really just like some fucking- Fucking dude's getting bopped on. Where am I at on the map? Almost to this bandit camp, I guess. Is this the camp? It looks like a bandit camp. But it also looks kind of like, oh yeah, shattered kiln. You doing this? I mean, it's here. They've set up an alarm. Don't want them to use it. Is that dude? 
Oh, I thought he was like just dancing. Yeah, tag them all. Tag them all. <laughs> Sound coming out of my controller. <laughs> oh, shit. We got prisoners. Dude, you're going to be a hero. Thank God. You think they're going to pay you? I hope so. Are those exploding barrels right there? The, these? Yeah, it looks the, like That's it. the alarm. Oh. Here. Oh, this is going to be awesome. What the f I don't know what that alarm is or what it does, but that's company. not what I expected. Oh, I didn't see her! Yep, there we go! No stealth, only metal on metal sounds. Just hacking away at her. Pretty hurt. Get pretty hurt. Didn't know my head. Gotta go. Never mind, never mind, never mind! I'm sorry! Holy shit, that was terrible. Whew. That was like something out of Texas Chainsaw. Yeah, that was Resident Evil 4 vibes. That was Toby Hooper coming at you. Shit. This is some Rob Zombie stuff. Wanna play? That person just paraphrased Chuck. <laughs> Wanna play? I can't believe there's still like child's play Chuck E media being produced on the reg. It's wild that Mark Hamill is Chucky now. Is he? Yeah, I haven't seen that new one. I don't think he is. I think he is. I think he was Chucky in that one movie. It's Chucky, but on, with... but on the series, I think it's. Uh, there's Europe. a there's a series. Oh man, season two is going to be a thing. I mean, I didn't watch it, but yeah. apparently people like it. The Aubrey Plaza movie has has. That's what I'm talking. About. That's Ma the one with Mark Hamill, Hamill right? Yeah. As Chucky, right? Right. You shoot a bomb at me, bro. Did you shoot a bum at the crew? Ow! What was that? Ugh, death. Ugh, I'm too tired after getting hit. I'm dead now. Dude, do you see how many guys there are? There's so many guys. You gotta get those guys. Purple. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me loot this purple. Alright, let's see what we can do here. This is crazy. Like, this area straight up looks like Outworlds. Boss dead. Woo! High ground. Hello. Yeah, Mark Hamill was the 2019 But Chucky. in the show? No, I think that's... Not the show. Brad Dourif? Yeah. From Blade? No, that's Steven Dourif. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, Brad, Brad has done the most for sure. He is Chucky. He's Chucky, yeah. He's like the OG. He's also... He's my friend to like... I knew Ow. he was in One Fool's a Cuckoo over a Cuckoo's Nest. Is he nominated for an Oscar in that? I don't know or about did that. did he win one? That's crazy. Is that real? Yeah, I Oscar mean... Oscar winner Brad Dorf? I don't know about that. Maybe nominated. Oh! Dude. Next time on Beer Bros, I'm coming back for these fuckers. That man had a gun. He just had a fucking Roman candle launcher. That's I don't even know exactly what the fuck what that, that was. was. Yeah. Damn. Right. Next time on Beard Bros, I will I will do better. I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye. Thanks everybody.